opportunity to celebrate the contributions of people of African descent, not only here in Vancouver, but across Canada, people from the continent, people from the diaspora, all over the world. And today, with Canada Post, we are also unveiling, uh, we're recognizing one of uh, Vancouver's most cherished citizens, Joe Forte. Joe's official role as the uh, city lifeguard, uh, obviously saving lives, uh, teaching people to swim, uh, that very, very important role in the earlier years of our city, but also his role as a friend and mentor to so many people, uh, being a real community leader who inspired many and was part of creating that positive change in the way, the attitude that people had towards uh, people of African descent during his lifetime. He was a great change maker and, uh, and dearly loved in his time. We are here to recognize him today and, uh, and to do an, a great unveiling with Canada Post. We are also honoring today uh, someone who has a great legacy of inspiring others and also taking a stand against racism, both in uh, personal and professional life, lives. And that, there are a lot of people that have fought hard to uh, eliminate racism and discrimination. And today we are going to celebrate the internationally uh, known and celebrated tap dancer, Jenny Lagon, who made her home in Vancouver. <laughs> we, um, she lived uh, here in Vancouver for uh, I think over 40 years. Uh, we are, are so sad of her passing uh, in December of 2012, but we are really honored that we have Mr. Frank Clavin here today, her partner, to, uh, to uh, come up and uh, and receive the formal proclamation of Black History Month in Vancouver uh, and say a few words as well. So this is a, a great honor for me to, to invite Mr. Frank Clavin up. Mm -hmm. 